Good morning you guys. Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Bianca. Just went and took a workout. This week it's been me and my mom again because Colin got COVID. So he has been quarantining at his house because um his family has it. So it's just me and my mom. That's why Colin's not in the vlogs again. Um, because the minute he started feeling good, he left. So he started not feeling good. He left. So He's quarantining away from us so me and the baby don't get sick. And so far, we are good. So I'm really, really, like, honestly just so thankful that we didn't get sick. So, yeah, I just went and took a workout. Now I'm about to switch with my mom so she can go work out and make myself some breakfast. So welcome back to another vlog. Let me pause this. Can you go without it for a second? She loves listening to Disney music. I play a Disney playlist on my phone all the time, and she really likes it. So... She's kind of a sad baby today, huh? Yesterday she was a really happy baby and today she's a little cranky. And just, you know, she's probably just tired but she won't sleep. So I just fed her and I'm gonna put her in her baby Bjorn bouncer and I'm gonna try and take a shower really quick and then make myself some breakfast and see um, how that goes. My mom just left to take an orange theory class. So yeah, but Lately, she's just been all about me, only wants mom, has to be with mom, 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 mom. So, I mean, I love it, but sometimes it's just hard to get things done, and then I feel bad for other people who are trying to hold her, too, and she's just, like, not having it. So, mm -hmm. yeah, anyway, we're just gonna give it a shot. I usually put her in her bouncer and then put her, a little play gym in front of her so she can kind of, like, feel the things, and I put it up on her, like waist area on the bouncer so um yeah but you can tell she's tired she's just like staring off into space so i'm gonna work on getting showered though and clean because it's so much easier to feed her i have to like wash my boobs off before i feed her when i'm like right after i work out because i've got like that sweaty sports bra on so now i just need to shower and get ready for the day but hello from Sut. So today's the first day we're trying out the taking care of babies. We have the PDF for months three and four. So um, yeah, trying that out. I will say I've learned a lot already. So um, I do think it was it's worth it. But um, that being said, we're just not starting it. So we'll have to update you guys. So wanted to show you guys my outfit for working out really quick. Um, but I wore my sport body shorty suit to work out today and it actually worked out well, but I didn't run, I power walked. And then I have on an aloe yoga sweatshirt and then just my nobles. So there's my little workout outfit. Hi was just getting ready to film a uh, TikTok and that's about it. But um, my mom and son are taking a nap on the couch right now and it's so cute. And then I was like using products, whatever, it got me thinking I should just do a little roundup of my favorite products for you guys and just share products that I think are absolutely worth buying. I'm gonna do it quick too because you know, I like things snappy and done quick. Ultra Repair Cream for your lotion from First Day Beauty. You can get it at Sephora or Ulta. All of them. You can just, I'll just have, you know what, I'll have this stuff like the OC Ocean Cleanser. I've used it for a couple days now since you guys saw me get it in the last vlog. And um, I did take a couple days break because of Colin getting COVID and like kind of things getting crazy for a second. But I've used it multiple times. It literally takes off all of my makeup. And my skin feels so good after it. I haven't had an allergic reaction. My skin loves it. I love it. The Giorgio Armani Fluid Sheer in number 10. I don't recommend this enough. Mix with your face moisturizer. So good. Um, the Summer Fridays Deep Hydration um, Dream Oasis Serum. Really good if you have dry skin. A day hair oil. My hair is so soft all the time because of this oil. And I just mix it in with... Um, like my hair styling cream whenever I blow dry my hair. A good, nice body cream, especially on days that like you self-tan and stuff and after if you want to put lotion on. I cannot recommend enough the Whey body cream. It smells amazing. I use this all the time. I leave the like protectors on them though because I don't want them to get messed up. Oh, it's so good and it's so hydrating for your skin. Lux Unfiltered number 32 Gradual Tan. For, like, not like a full-on self-tan, like a gradual buildable tan. I would get this. I've been loving the Say Liquid Blush. Really good. Okay, last product, the Rare Beauty um, Tinted Moisturizer. 
I think it's the best tinted moisturizer I've ever used and since it's summer I wear tinted moisturizer the most um, if I have anything on my face right now I actually don't I just have concealer on my face oh my god what's on my forehead um, but for eyebrows if you just want to like fill in your eyebrows the NYX lift and snatch brow tint pen I love a lot because you can just draw really thin fine lines on your eyebrows I think that's really good I'm still looking for like the best mascara oh oh hold on Kosas Concealer. Once I got the right shade, everything was really good. I love the Kosas Concealer. It doesn't crease or anything. I think it's so good. Also, I forgot the Summer Fridays Vitamin C um, Under Eye Peptide. Really good. If you can shop these Skin Farm products online, I will link them. Specifically, the Hyaluronic Acid and the Vitamin C Serum. These two. My skin is totally different because of these. I'm convinced. I do like their sunscreen too, the sheer defense, it kind of just adds a little glow I'm wearing it too. Jeez. That's my little roundup of products that I'm like obsessed with right now. I'm going to go tend to Sun and she's probably hungry and then I'm going to film my TikTok which is my cotton on haul from the last vlog. Hi. Hey. Hi. 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 Do you see her? Yesterday we got way, 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 way off schedule because Sutton did not sleep as long during her naps. But today we're doing much, much better. So um, she's down for her first nap of the day. While she was doing tummy time, I quickly just like threw on some blush, eyebrows, and mascara and concealer. Um, and now I'm getting some chores done. So like making the bed. I am putting away... This is Murphy's donut. He sleeps with that night. I'm putting away, because we don't use them anymore, my nursing pillow. Um, and then our Sparkle Me Organic lounger. It's just too big for it now. These are just going to go in our storage closet back here. feeding her I just finished watching the summer I turned pretty since Colin is gone for the week mr. sick man um, I decided to watch it because it's something he would never watch therefore I would have never watched it if he was still here because we only really watch TV like at night um, but I've been watching it at night and I just finished it while I was feeding her and it was like 
it was pretty good I, I my favorite type of shows are psychological thrillers so typically i wouldn't go for like a show like that like little love romancy young adult type situation but i really liked it i did not read the book i honestly need to get back into reading that's one of my goals for july is to like <laughs> change that about myself and just kind of do more things that i used to do before i had her to make me feel more like myself aka getting back into a good workout routine so i've been power walking at orange theory for the past three classes and it has not affected my milk supply at all and i've just been lifting a little bit lighter and wait you guys should see <laughs> she's like staring at me like hi so cute while i'm talking but it hasn't affected my milk supply so now i feel way better about working out and i'm like excited to work out again but before i had i feel like i had a really bad relationship i guess with working out because it just kept affecting my milk supply and then it would stress me out and then it would stress me out that i couldn't work out and i felt like i couldn't work out and i just needed to make that small change so i still want to try a pilates class but it's just kind of hard when colin's gone for me to like go try a class um so i'm gonna wait until he, yeah i'm gonna wait till he comes home before i do that anyway i just finished the summer i turned pretty it was very good i enjoyed it you guys will have to tell me if you watched it and if you liked it but the end was so sad i was literally about to start bawling and i was like hold it together so i chugged my water and i held it together yeah mommy can cry no wasn't in the mood to cry today um so you guys know we're going to the beach i keep ordering clothes for the beach but i ordered more clothes and i'm probably still going to order more clothes i have been like purging my closet and pretty much starting over put some stuff up on poshmark probably gonna put some more stuff up eventually but i just like i'm so lost with my wardrobe and my style right now mainly because i'm just like i just i just don't know what to wear and so i've been ordering clothes i'm about to place an h&m order i'm about to order some clothes on amazon and hi um I ordered some more clothes from Abercrombie because I'm obsessed. So I'll have to show you guys those in a minute because they came. And I got the 90s like curve love straight leg pants that were trending on TikTok or whatever. Um, but they aren't coming until next week for some reason. So I'll have to show you guys those when they come. And also our bed frame delivers tomorrow. Can you believe that? Our bed frame comes tomorrow. I also ordered a bathing suit from Aerie and a strapless bra because i really needed a strapless bra and a double d because i only have it in a b because there's my old boob size can you believe you i for you i've gone from a b to a double d a b to a double d just for you just for you crazy right things i'll do for you the things i would do for you so we're just hanging on the couch. My mom went to Orange Theory today. I took today off because I am so sore from the past two days. It's bad. But she stopped by Publix on the way home. And I think we're having pub subs for lunch. At least that's what she said she was getting. So I guess pub subs it is. Way better quality. Hi. Hi. We've gone through bath time and feedings and now I just laid Sutton down in her bassinet. Drowsy, but still awake. And she's not okay with it. So um, I was messaging with my friend Elle. She said, like, you just have to be really patient, which I am a pretty patient person, so that's really good. But, well, I mean, when it comes to Sutton, I'm really patient. Other things, not so much. But when it comes to her, I, I definitely think I'm really, really patient. So, we laid her down, and now it's just like a process. There's a whole step-by-step, -step, um, like, kind of like sleep intervention thing that you go through. And so, I'm waiting just a little bit before I have to go do the first one, because she's still kind of like up and talking. Oh, hold on one second. Hello. I just worked out and it was brutal but we are doing it anyway because it makes us feel good got the goods I'm blocking my address sticker thing and I also got Murph's dog food so we actually um transferred him to this new dog food since he's been an adult 
one year old dog um and he's obsessed so i'll have to tell you guys about it look what we got murphy and your new dog food okay so this brand reached out and wanted to work with me and it's called sundays it's dog food and so i was like well i want murphy to try it first but i was intrigued because it's literally 100 percent whole foods in dog food and i'm intrigued too because the food that we had murphy on murphy's always been a grazer and i just thought he was a grazing kind of dog um because all of our other dogs have always eaten their food like right away and so i was like oh murphy just grazes for instance here's his breakfast so we tried out this other dog food and he literally ate it right away like it was spot bowl was licked clean and we we're like oh, okay interesting and so then I gave all of the stuff that they sent me for him to try it. We ran out and then I was like, okay, well he's gonna have to go back to the old dog food until I can order more. So I ordered more with like my own money. I am gonna work with them because I think that their food is so good. And so we just ordered our, I, we, yeah, we ordered Murphy some more and this is just gonna be the food he eats because he's obsessed and it's so good for him. Oh my God, cute. Came with stickers, Murph. Look what it is. <gasps> Look what it is, buddy. Um, so I'm excited to work with him, but I'm also excited because when we gave him this other food, he looked pissed. <laughs> Don't you think? It looks really cool and it's extremely nutrient dense. And um, this video isn't sponsored by them, by the way. I'm just telling you what's in it. Okay, so this is everything that's in it. Chicken, chicken liver, egg, millet, oat, pumpkin, kale, ground bone, fish oil, sea salt, flaxseed, parsley, turmeric, chicory root, chicory root, chicory root, chicory root, one of those, kelp, mixed, toco, formolos, ginger, blueberries, carrots, apples, tomatoes, shiitake mushroom, broccoli, orange, cranberry, spinach, beet, tart, cher cherries, and strawberries. Is it chitney? No. Oh, okay. Here, look. Chicory. Oh, chicory root. Anyway, so then also they have this really cool like function on their website where, wait, I'm making sure something's not awake. She looks like she's awake. You can put in your old dog food brand and they'll compare the two to this. Well, they'll compare it to this brand. And so I put in Purina Pro Plan, whatever. And it said that it was like good, but there's a few things that it was like had a couple chemicals in it and I was like oh man and we obviously want Murphy to live forever so I literally bought more and he's literally right here so good. and I've said literally twice now so that's fine okay so I took a quick little break because Colin got home and uh, then it was almost time for his son to take a nap so also I showered and put blush and mascara and eyebrows on and now we're gonna do the bed I'm so excited and um, I need Colin to get up and help me. Now, please. We're about to open them. We just vacuumed and moved everything. And I'm so excited. bed frame would fit on our like um current bed frame and it doesn't fit around it but the box spring what 
said watch yourself on the night. Oh, the box spring for this is coming Wednesday, so we'll just have to finish this Wednesday. But um, all of this came like way faster than I thought it was going to, too, so, okay. Um, thought I had time to order it, and I didn't, but it's coming Wednesday. And then you, it literally just like sits behind. I don't know why there's Velcro. So, totally sucks, but We'll just have to wait until our box spring gets here. Um, but I got a few more things from the beach yesterday and that I wanted to show you guys. First being this bikini from Aerie. So I got this in a size XL. And then um, I got the bottoms in a, my normal size medium. So I already tried it on. It looks so cute. You guys will just have to see it on Instagram or something i don't know if i'm gonna vlog next week i'm still deciding and then i also got this strapless bra so you can take bra straps off in a 36 double d and it fits so there's some nursing boobs for you and then i also got an order in from abercrombie so i got in these shorts they're like cargo shorts how cute are these adorable i got a size medium and then I got three more tanks of my favorite black tank from them. So I got green, and then I got brown, and then also white. So I got that, and then I did get some tube tops to wear because I thought that they'd be really easy to nurse in, and also I just thought they were cute. So I got white, and then they're also like this ribbed material. I also got black. So one of the biggest questions I get is, is Love Every worth it? And if you didn't know, Love Every is her little play gym um, that has the three sides and the colorful mat. Here, let me show you. This is her Love Every play gym. And so I just wanted to go over with you guys what I thought about it because I really do get questions about it a lot. And in my personal opinion, I think it's 100% worth it. She loves it. You can put little cards up here at the top so she can just lay down and look at them. Um, and they're just little black and white cards, but she loves to stare up at them. It has different attachments for you to put um, dangling down on the sides. She likes to kick them with her feet. And then on the outside, there's a bunch of different sections. So there's like a tactile section, um, one that she can feel, hear noises with. She, there's a mirror and another little thing, thing on that side. And then also like a squeaker, but we don't try and squeak it because if we did, then Murphy would try and take the squeaker out of it. Um, as long, like at least when Murphy's not around and then it also comes with different little um, attachments that she likes to play with like right now she's super into crinkling this and it all comes with and then also Love Every sends you so, I can't do anything without Murphy being like all in my business um, Love Every sends you this little play guide so it's this one's zero to 12 weeks, so right now she needs the next one, but it basically tells you like the stages that they'll go through and what you can do with them. So like building strength during tummy time, and it says how to do it, and why you should do it, and things that you can do. So it's honestly really cool, and also if you're a first time mom like me, I never, like I don't know what to do, I really don't know what I'm doing half the time. So I'm like, okay, at what stage am I supposed to be doing this? Like when, you know, you, you know what I'm saying, like developmental wise every so yeah as you can see it just goes through walks you through creating a peaceful space developing hand control I really liked this page a lot but there are just, just so many things that I don't already know <laughs> and I like had questions about and love every is seriously so worth it it helps you so much Helps me know what to do. Gives me ideas of how to play with her throughout the day. And like exposing your baby to language, for instance. This is like a little activity that we would do um, in between her nap time. Who are you thinking? I think you got a little booger right there. Thanks. Mom got it. And baby massage. Anyway, those are just some examples of like what comes in the booklet what comes with this it gives you ideas of how to play with her with this and I honestly love it like for growth and development for throughout their first couple months is so important too and like what you do with them is so important and helping them like grow and learn so um 
yeah i just honestly really couldn't recommend it enough and i'll link it below for you guys they did send me this this is gifted um but it's so worth it and if it wasn't i would have bought it with my own money because i've already heard so many good things from other people as well so i'm super thankful that they sent me this and obviously we love it so much and it's honestly just really entertaining because there's so much to do she never gets bored and i do like the colors there's another side there's another side too that you could put up but i flipped it over because i like this side a lot and yeah we just really like it there's also a little dream drape i just really think it's worth it especially for giving you something to do in between nap time that's like beneficial towards them and their development every single time we do a tummy time or anything like that he just lays right there oh also i wanted to mention i love how wide it is because eventually they'll start to roll over and she has so much room to roll over so yeah it's just crazy how much they change so quick look at what colin made hibachi but this time they're shrimp so it's a little different guys we're picking up the vlog now again um you guys are gonna see this today so hello but um our box spring box what what is it box frame bed frame box frame. Oh, box yeah, spring I, I don't know what it's called we got a button right here oh. hi oh just a pass um, it came from Amazon, so I'll have this link down below. I would definitely recommend getting this if you end up getting the bed frames that we get. Um, because even hey, on the no website, sir. it says to get this, the soft frame website. And I was like, eh, I'm going to try it on this first. It just didn't work out. So it's here. Now we're finally putting the bed together. Thank you so much for watching. We're sad. Um, and I will see you guys in.